All right, so here's the issue. I'm on old Highway 40 right now. Normally they shut this gate down, uh, but there's still cars back here. But when I-80 actually backs up, Google Maps and other internet maps will send you on Highway 40 here or other back roads. Problem is, this road doesn't get plowed. And if you look behind me, there's a whole pile up of cars. This is what it looks like when GPS takes you the wrong way, and CHP Sergeant Brian Yops has to save you. Google or Garmin, it'll tell you the fastest route, and if the freeway is stopped, it'll pick side roads, back streets, and whatever, and it doesn't take uh, weather into account. Warning signs at lower elevations on I-80 are telling people to prepare for the snow and long waits, but if you look at your GPS, it tells a different story. Yes, his navigation took him here, but my navigation took us to 80. These folks are just trying to get back to Sacramento, but ended up on Donner Pass Road because they had two different GPS units that weren't matching up. Why, is, why are you going this way? We're going down Donner Pass. Remember in elementary school you had learned about the Donner, the Donner family? Uh -huh. That's what I felt like. If you thought that family was lost, listen to this guy's story. Otherwise known as Bushman Ali. Bushman Ali. I'm you, straight from the jungles of uh, Central America. What are you doing in these parts? I, that's a good question. Bushman Ali is headed back to Reno, of all places. He wants to buy a camper so he can go back to Chapas, Mexico and look for this bird. Uh -huh. Anyway, this is the horned guan. All right. It's one of the rarest birds on earth. It lives in the cloud forests only in Chiapas, which is in southern Mexico and Guatemala. Mm -hmm. Is this oh. is this a that, is, is this a bird you would see in the snow? You think they have snow in Chiapas, Mexico? No, no. So it, it, well, I guess we're both lost. But I did ask Bushman Ollie how he planned to get home. You have a map in here. You're not using GPS. I've never used GPS. Don't be trying to drive these roads if you don't have chains or you'll be just like these people right here. I'm John Bartel, ABC 10 News.